Right, this question. Water flows through a cylindrical pipe of radius 0.74 centimetres. It fills a 12 litre bucket in four minutes. Calculate the speed of the water through the pipe in centimetres per minute. Right, calculate the speed. Okay, so one formula we're gonna need for this is speed equals distance divided by time. And the, the first part of the question tells you you've got a cylindrical pipe, which obviously has a volume. And so the total water flowing through that pipe to fill up a bucket, a 12 litre bucket, means that the total uh, volume of that pipe is uh, 12 litres. And so the, the other formula you're going to need is the formula for um, volume of a cylinder, which is the area of the end, which is pi r squared times the length of the pipe. Um, th this, in this case, it's distance. So we can call it length, or if the cylinder's upright, then it will be height. So let's call it the length of the pipe for now. So you've got, so doing the first bit, You've got volume, which is get. Let's get the um, uh, the, the scale right. Twelve thousand um, milliliters um, is equal to pi radius times 0.74 squared times the length, which is the, basically the distance that you're trying to find out. So now rearranging this equation to get the length on one side, you've got twelve thousand divided by pi times the radius squared is equal to your length. Uh, let's see the calculator here. Uh, so 12,000 divided by pi times 0 0.74 squared is equal to um, 6,975.381. So that's how many, uh, that's the length in centimeters um, of, the, of the pipe. So that's your length. Right, so now you've got, you go back to this formula, the speed equals distance over time you can calculate the speed now because you know the distance that the water's traveled along that pipe. So I have to move this up now. So hang on. I'll make sure I get it on the camera. So speed is equal to the distance, which is the length you've just worked out. So 6,975.381 divided by, you've been asked to give the, the answer in centimetres per minute, so you can divide that directly by four minutes. And that's going to give you, divided by four, is 1743 centimetres per minute. And then usually you've got to give these uh, to three significant figures. So you, you will give the answer 1,740 centimetres per minute. That's done.